How to let Canva start your closure project and connect, aka jack in. To make it easy to connect VS Code to closure projects, Calva has taken inspiration from Cider. With some user input, Calva can figure out how to start your projects. We call it jack in, as that is what Cider calls it, and it also sounds cool. This is what it looks like when jacking in to a jacked edge project with front end batteries included. First, issue your jack in command. A project types menu pops open. In this case, Calva detects that it is a closure CLI project. It is also an edge project which comes with pre configured custom sale.js REPL startup. Then select which builds Calva should start. The edge developer guide tells us to start dev, build, and dev slash build. Calva then cooks the command line and starts the closure process as a VS Code task. This gives the user control of the process using the task UI. Once the project is compiled, the end REPL server is started. Calva connects to it and opens a REPL window, ready for your closure experiments. Now we are waiting for FigWheel to compile all the things. The custom configuration tells Calva to print the relevant log lines to the Calva CES output. This will give us the URL to the frontend app so that we can start it and let Calva complete the REPL connection. There the log line is. There the app starts. There the closure script REPL window opens. Let's convince ourselves that Calva really is connected to our frontend application. Now let's evaluate the sale.js file and some code. Calva has quite a few evaluation commands. I'm only going to show you two of the inline variants here. Evaluating the current form and the current top level form. Calva considers everything at the top level of a comments form as top level, making code experimentation easy. There is your proof. The Calva ads don't lie. You just jack in and hack away.